and I just like being outside. Winter was long, I felt like. Now this coronavirus has everything shut down, so it's a perfect time to get in the woods. I had originally planned on doing a lot more automotive photography. Uh, once this coronavirus hit though, I was like, well, I'm gonna use this time to rent me a big lens and just do some wildlife photography. Because I mean, you can always go out in the woods, you're not gonna get corona out here, and I'm not gonna spread corona. So, win-win, right? Dude, so I got this, this Sigma 150 to 600, I'll do a nice slow-mo slow-mo and I got I rented this lens and I fell in love with it not necessarily the the lens but just the the, the craft of wildlife photography There's so much to look at and see out here I'm working with two cameras at the moment I got my my Nikon on my back like I was saying I got this action cam and the action cam is good for these shots but I'm still trying to figure out the slow mos and the, the b-roll because if I hand hold this camera I get I get some shake it doesn't have that internal body stabilization set up so yeah now, I mean I'll be honest I'm not like a I'm not, I'm not some kind of biology expert uh, I don't really know the names of all these animals but fucking who cares man I just like to I like to listen to them I like to watch them live their lives um, just being out here being an animal ourselves yeah My wife and I went to this this pond this morning. We were looking for to get pictures of a beaver. That'd be cool. Also, you'll notice on my back, oh, my new gimbal head came in. <laughs> I'm really excited to use that today. I had that ball joint head, which works phenomenally for landscape photos but when I put that the big telescope telescopic 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 lens on there it, it kind of suffers so I ordered this gimbal head it's not one of those motor balancing ones but it it, it, uh, it doesn't need to be so yeah I'm really excited to use that it'll be it'll help me maintain focus a lot better I'm gonna have to lower my voice a little bit. I spooked a couple deer back there. And I'll throw my camo on in a second. <laughs> All right, <laughs> nailed it. Right, I'm gonna go back. Let's see. Uh. <laughs> what good is it coming in the woods if you're not gonna play around, eh? This is my camera. I'm rocking the the D7500. Uh, let's see if you can see it. Do, 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 do. So yeah, yeah, the D7500. Yeah, I mean, if you're a photographer, you know about cameras, or you'll look up the specs. This one's pretty good for wildlife photography. I like it. If you have questions about cameras, I can help you with Nikon. If you have questions of other brands, I don't know shit. So, uh, I like Nikon. Uh, ergonomics is a big piece for me, and I feel like Nikon really 
nails that field. So, plus I grew up with them. My mom always had Nikons. So, if you were curious, if you were not curious, then this is my camera. I like it. Drink water, drive on, huh? Germans drink this bubbly water. I like it. Took a while to get used to. But it was pretty good. Got some camo in. Dude, I got this face mask. Gloves. Be ready to go. I put this on already. At uh, Woodpecker's house is only probably know, a couple hundred meters from here. So I want to move in slow, get situated, get sitting. And hopefully something else will walk up on me also. But today I'm here for the Woodpecker. Let's go. Spotted woodpecker lives in the tree. About Forty feet from me, forty feet up, and he's been going around to all the other trees, chipping out the wood, finding food and housing material, and that's what I've been getting on tape. I had to move. I wasn't getting enough light in my camera. My ISO was getting too high. I 
I was walking back to my car. And show my Yeah, that's cool. My light sensitivity is through the, is at 12,000, so I imagine these, so the quality is going to be a little grainy, but still, it's fucking cool. Yeah, that's a great way to finish it off. So yeah, man, I'm going to make more of these. I'm loving it. Uh, I like being outside. I like watching the animals. I'm going to figure out how to get a little bit of con con conservation conservation in the mix. And yeah, man. <laughs> Go out and enjoy your local wildlife. Remember, like the video subscribe if that's something you're into it helps me and <laughs> I get to film deer grazing in a friggin field of yellow flowers that is so cool here shut up yeah I'll post a video online man alright y'all have, have a good week love you